It is common at any point in time for your students to forget their Blackboard username or password. In this screencast today, we cover how you can teach your students how to properly log into Blackboard and how to verify their username and change their password if needed. To begin, go to gccd.blackboard.com. On the login page, you will see in this section instructions on how to log into Blackboard. If students are having issues logging into their Blackboard account, instruct them to click on the detailed login instructions link for further assistance. It will take them to a video tutorial that will guide them step by step on how to log into Blackboard and fix any errors that may come up. This screencast is only seven minutes long and is something I highly recommend faculty watch as well. If students are still unable to log into their Blackboard account after watching the video screencast, you will need to verify their username and reset their password. To begin, log into your Blackboard account and select a course container that you are currently using. Once you are in your course container, go to your control panel, click on Users and Groups, and then click on Users. This is where you can view your complete roster, verify students' usernames, and change their password. Take note that the Find Users to Enroll button is only reserved for admin accounts since faculty members do not have rights to enroll students. To continue, if a student is having issues logging into Blackboard, you first want to verify their username. Locate the student in reference and look for the student's username under the username column. Send that information to the student to confirm that they are using the correct username. To change their password, click on the drop down arrow button to the right of their name, then click the Change Users Password link. From there, fill out the form provided and enter in a new password for the student in question. Typically, by default, it is preferred that you reset the student's password to their six-digit birth date. Once that's completed, click the Submit button to save this change. It is also recommended that you pay special attention to the email column. If you plan on communicating with your students on a regular basis via email, you want to make sure that you and your students have a valid email address listed in the Blackboard roster. If you take notice for this particular student, you will see that this student has the email address of update.email at webadvisor. This clearly states that this student does not have a valid email address listed on Blackboard and will not receive any email updates that you may send to your class. Take note that this issue could apply to the instructor as well. To resolve this issue, this student or the instructor needs to log into their WebAdvisor account and provide a valid email address. WebAdvisor is the controlling database for Blackboard and will update Blackboard within 24 hours after any changes have been made. You can access a tutorial on how to change your email address within WebAdvisor by going to the Online Success website at gccd.edu forward slash online. Click on the Faculty Support link and then click on the Blackboard Tutorials link. Scroll down the page until you see the tutorial entitled Change Your Email Address. Click on that link and it will bring up a PDF document that will go over step by step on how to change your email address in WebAdvisor. It is highly recommended that you either print or download this PDF document for your personal use. That concludes this screencast on how to verify usernames, change passwords, and update your email address for Blackboard 9.1 Service Pack 13.